if I told you that a spacecraft launched them nearly 50 years ago just detected something so mysterious, so unexpected that it could rewrite everything we know about the universe? This isn't science fiction. It's Voyager 1's latest revelation. For thousands of years, humanity has gazed into the night sky, searching for meaning in the stars. The question has always haunted us. Are we alone? Or is there something or someone waiting out there? In 1977, humanity decided to stop wondering and start reaching. That's when Voyager 1 took flight, not just as a machine of science, but as a bold messenger, carrying the voice of Earth into the endless unknown. With it went the golden record, a time capsule of greetings, music, and sounds of our world, our cosmic message in a bottle, drifting endlessly across the galactic ocean. Voyager's first mission was ambitious, to visit Jupiter and Saturn, and it delivered beyond imagination. At Jupiter, it revealed raging storms, hidden rings, and volcanic eruptions on Io, discoveries that completely rewrote our knowledge of the gas giant. Then at Saturn, it exposed the delicate complexity of its rings and unveiled Titan's thick orange haze, hinting at mysteries we still wrestle with today. But Saturn was only the beginning. Voyager 1 was pulled onto a new path, one that would send it beyond the planets, beyond the sun's protective bubble, and into true interstellar space. By 2012, it crossed that invisible boundary, becoming humanity's first emissary into the space between the stars. Now, more than 16 billion miles from Earth, Voyager 1 drifts where no human creation has ever gone. At that distance, even light itself takes over 24 hours to carry a message from Earth to the probe, and another 24 hours for Voyager to reply. Every signal we receive is like a postcard from eternity. And then something astonishing happened. In late 2024, Voyager picked up a signal scientists never expected. A deep, repeating wave pulsing through interstellar space. Steady, coherent, and powerful. At first, many thought it was an error, a malfunction. But no, it was real. A cosmic rhythm repeating every 18 months, resonating through the plasma of the galaxy. Researchers have named it the interstellar heartbeat. What could cause such an orderly signal in the emptiness between stars? Is it the stirring of massive cosmic objects? Could dark matter itself be pulsing in rhythm? Or is it something we don't yet have the language to describe? Whatever it is, Voyager 1 has shown us that interstellar space is not silent. It is alive with energy, with motion, and with secrets still hidden. Voyager's journey is racing against time. The spacecraft, though a marvel of 1970s engineering, is not eternal. At its heart lies its power source a radioisotope thermoelectric generator, or RTG. This device works by converting the heat from decaying plutonium-238 into electricity. It was chosen because unlike solar panels, which become useless in the dim outskirts of the solar system, an RTG provides steady power, no matter how far Voyager travels. But like an hourglass slowly running out of sand, the plutonium is decaying, and the heat it generates is fading year after year. When Voyager 1 launched in 1977, its RTG produced around 470 watts of power. Today, after nearly five decades in the deep freeze of space, it generates less than half that. To keep the spacecraft alive, NASA's engineers have been forced to make painful decisions. One by one, instruments have been shut down to conserve energy. The cameras, which once sent back breathtaking images of Jupiter and Saturn, are long gone switched off decades ago. The ultraviolet spectrometer, gone. The infrared sensors, gone. What remains are only a handful of scientific tools, carefully selected to stretch the mission's final years as far as possible. The truth is sobering. By around 2036, the generator will no longer produce enough electricity to power even a single instrument, let alone the spacecraft's transmitter. When that day comes, Voyager 1's voice will go silent forever. After nearly 60 years of sending humanity's story across billions of miles, it will no longer be able to speak. And yet, this slow decline makes every single signal more valuable than gold. Imagine this, a tiny spacecraft, no larger than a family car, floating over 16 billion miles from Earth, sending a radio signal with the strength of a refrigerator light bulb. That faint whisper must cross the vast gulf of interstellar space, battling background radiation and cosmic noise before being caught by giant radio dishes on Earth. The fact that we can even hear Voyager today is nothing short of miraculous. Every bit of data it transmits, whether a measurement of plasma density, a reading of magnetic fields, or the haunting rhythm of the interstellar heartbeat, is precious. Each transmission is like a postcard from a frontier no human has ever visited. There is something profoundly human about Voyager's struggle against time. It reflects our own existence, our awareness that life is finite. 
Just as we treasure the fleeting moments of our lives, so too do scientists and engineers cherish the last messages from this aging traveler. Voyager has become more than just a machine. It is a companion, a witness to our collective dream of reaching beyond the stars. And when Voyager finally does fall silent, its journey will not truly end. Though its transmitter will fade, its body will continue to drift through interstellar space for billions of years. It carries with it the golden record, a carefully crafted time capsule of humanity's voice, our music, our laughter, even greetings in dozens of languages. Long after Earth has changed, long after civilizations rise and fall, Voyager will still be out there, silently gliding between the stars, carrying a memory of who we were. It may never be found, but if it is, it will stand as proof that a small world once dared to dream. Until then, the clock is ticking. With every passing year, Voyager's nuclear heart grows dimmer, its instruments shutting down one by one in a carefully chosen sequence to preserve the mission for as long as possible. The spacecraft is fragile, yet its voice still travels billions of miles through the darkness, sending back faint signals that carry the weight of human ambition. Each whisper across the void is more than just data. It is a reminder of what humanity can achieve when we dare to dream beyond our limits. Voyager proves that true exploration is not about comfort, safety, or convenience. It is about courage, the willingness to face uncertainty, to embrace the unknown, and to push forward even when success is not guaranteed. This little probe, with less computing power than a modern digital watch, continues to challenge the boundaries of possibility. It shows us that imagination, paired with determination, can overcome impossible odds. Voyager is not only a machine of science, but a symbol of humanity's restless spirit, a beacon of curiosity still shining against the infinite backdrop of space. And as long as it speaks, it reminds us that discovery is worth every risk. As we listen to Voyager's fading heartbeat, we are reminded of a profound truth. Discovery has never been about the destination alone. It is about the odyssey itself, the courage to step into the unknown, and the relentless pursuit of knowledge, even when answers seem just out of reach. Voyager's journey is a testament to human endurance, proving that even with the limited technology of the 1990s, we dared to dream beyond the horizon of our own world. It carries within it not only instruments and data, but also the hopes questions, and imagination of an entire species. Though its power is dwindling and its voice grows fainter with each passing year, Voyager's journey is our journey. And as long as it sails through the stars, it tells us one thing clearly, our exploration of the universe has only just begun.